Hey, thanks for taking the time to watch this video and to learn OneNote. We want as many people as possible to learn how to work effectively with tools like OneNote, Office 365 and Surface. So please refer this series to your friends and colleagues. If you really want to have an impact with your team, the most effective way is to set aside time each week to improve your digital skills. You can set up this process in your organization with our Microsoft 365 coaching programs. Check out the link below to see our instructor facilitated coaching programs and contact us for more information. Are you ready to get productive with OneNote? OneNote has some great tools for working with pictures. To insert a picture in OneNote, click on Insert, Pictures, browse your computer and select an image to put onto your page. Once you've got the image onto your page, you'll notice that there's not a lot of controls that we have in OneNote for manipulating the picture. We can't change the color or balance or anything like that. We can't manipulate the picture. We can't crop the picture. There's only very simple and limited tools for working with pictures in OneNote. You can rotate the image. You can set it as the background, or you can adjust the order of the image. If you need to do more work with the image, you'll need to do that in a different program, perhaps like the Microsoft Photos app. If you want your picture to appear as the background of your page, in other words, a picture that doesn't move even when you move other content around, right click on it and set it as the background of the page. Another picture tool that we have in OneNote is from camera. So if you click on insert pictures from camera, this will launch the camera on your device. So if you have a device like the Surface Pro with the rear facing camera, you can capture a picture directly onto your OneNote page. This feature here uses tools built into the Microsoft Office Lens app. As I take the photo, you'll see that OneNote automatically detects the edges and corners of the document and squares up the photo just like it was scanned onto the page. The final tool for inserting pictures into OneNote under Insert Pictures is from online. And this simply opens a search bar on the right hand side of OneNote that allows you to search for an image using the Bing search engine. Now that you know how to work with pictures, you're ready to get productive with OneNote. Plane flying over. OneNote has some great tools for working with pictures and screen screenshots and puts it into the document just like it was a scanned document. Too many documents. So now that you can work with pictures in OneNote, you're ready to get productive with OneNote. <laughs>